was trying to teach my daughter how to tie her shoes and it was not going well. I was trying to teach her just the bunny ears method and it was not clicking for her, which I can understand. It took me a long time to learn how to tie my shoes when I was a kid too. And theoretically she could possibly not have shoes that need to be tied, but right now she does. So I have seen this method going around the internet for teaching kids how to tie shoes. You tuck the ends of the laces into either the holes where the laces go in or just into the shoe and then they tie two knots and then their shoes are double knotted. It is the coolest thing ever. So I showed my daughter how to do this and she caught it in two days. So I could not recommend this method more because this is a life skill. I decided to make a life skill download for this. So what I did was I created the steps for this life skill and then I created images showing how the tying of the shoelaces should look so that there is a visual for this because I know a lot of people are very visual when it comes to things like this. So once I had all of that ready, I printed it out and this is just two pages. And then I also have the listed checklist if that's something that's better for whoever needs this life skill download. This time I decided to make this a flip book so that we could take it with us wherever we go in case my daughter needed to reference back to it. I just think this is a nice way to carry it around with you. Obviously you can do whatever you feel like is going to be best for the person that is going to be using this life skill download. If you feel like you need to laminate it and put it on the wall and that's the best way for them to see it, then you do that. I have so many different ways that I show how to use my downloads that I have on my site because I want them to be as useful as possible for people and not pigeonholed into one way of using them. So to make the booklet, I printed out the pages and then I cut out each square. There are six squares on each page. Once I had them all cut out, I tried to make sure that they were all the same size because they were not based on how they printed. Once they were all the same size, I then just used the hole punch, punched a hole in them and put a metal ring through them. And then we had a flip book and it was super easy to use. So I now have this in my bag that we carry around with us in case my daughter needs to reference back to it, which we have a couple of times, but I can now confidently say that she can be out in public and sit down and tie her shoes. It is not quick. We're still working on that, but she can effectively tie her shoes on her own, which was the goal of this life skill. In the long term, I would like it so that she didn't have to have shoes that she needs to tie, but these are her favorite shoes and they do require to be tied sometimes, not all the time. And yes, those shoes were incredibly dirty. We are currently in a battle of wills over whether or not she needs to have these shoes replaced. They clearly need to be replaced, but she's not on that team. We're getting there. You can find this life skill download along with all of my other life skill downloads and all of my other downloads on my website, breezingthrough.com under shop, and they are $5 each. Mm -hmm.